Respond to all clients within two hours. I mean, obviously, the less, the better. Uh, but two hours is a good rule of thumb. Uh, and if it, it doesn't have to be the full answer the client is looking for or an explanation to why uh, performance is tanking, it could simply be, hey, client, uh, thanks for reaching out. Uh, I will uh, regroup with the team, and I will circle back with some updates, for example. Letting the client know that you are there for them, giving them that reassurance that if things go away and they need to get a hold of you, they can very easily uh, reach you uh, because you are there for them. And most importantly, of course, uh, follow up, follow up, follow up. Very important to follow up after each meeting or any milestone events uh, to make sure that you are uh, as well documenting uh, the next steps, action items, and recapping the meetings so that anybody can go down and reference all of those notes in the future. A lot of times when you're dealing with advertising, you are involved in many different verticals, many different types of businesses. So understanding how each business operates will give you that advantage to be able to consult, to be able to go further and beyond uh, and offer solutions that are relevant to the business. And that's very, very important because at the end, results are at stake. So make sure you do your research, ask the right questions at the right time. And what that means is you're not going to wait until a campaign launches two weeks in, you'll reach out to the client and say, hey client, um, who are your clients? Who are your target demographic? Who is your audience? So of course, uh, ask proactively, uh, ask the right questions at the right time, and once again, document everything. Before I leave, I, I do wanna leave you with a quote from Gary Vaynerchuk that uh, sums this up pretty well. Hard work is the byproduct of the full commitment to a smart strategy. Keep that in mind, please, if you are looking for a role within client services and are looking for the advantage, this is it. Uh, it doesn't have to be within a work environment. Uh, pick something up on the side, build a WordPress site, do some research a little bit in depth with regards to, let's say, uh, a pay-per-click. Don't have to put money behind it, but there are a lot of simulators out there that will help you have that hands-on experience that will help you when you do get into the workforce to be in that step up position. And then finally, when you are in front of the client, uh, strategy should be the focal point. Strategy should always be the focal point because strategy ladders up to results, which ladders up to ROI, which ladders up to a yes or a no by the client if they do want to keep you or go to another agency.